Breakfast today is going to be onigiri. I got this omelette rice one. It has a similar kind of tomatoey look to it with uh, an egg wrapped all around it. And I also got this plum shiso flavored one. And I'm hoping it's gonna be like that pickled plum on the inside. There's like a purple rice and it's wrapped in tofu. Hubby has three onigiri. This one is chicken nan bun, miso katsu, and soy sauce tuna mayo. This tastes really good. I definitely like the um, flavored rice ones a lot more. I find the rice is a lot more moist and delicious. I also really like doing combini breakfast. I remember at the Intercontinental we got the room with the additional breakfast and breakfast is really expensive at hotels. I feel like at the buffet you try to eat a lot to kind of get your money's worth, but then you're too full to eat other things. And a lot of locals go to Kombini's too, and it's just part of the culture or the way of life here. So yeah, really, really enjoying our little nibbles and such in the morning. Once again, I am drinking Tully's black coffee. We're gonna have breakfast and then head to a cooking class. was tons of fun. We are going to go to Daiso now to see if we can pick up some of the stuff that they use there. On our way, we saw this Hello Kitty parking lot. So cute. And there's a Hello Kitty vending machine behind me here. We're going to a baseball game. We're gonna be watching the Hanshin Tigers. And we just got here. It was super easy. I'm gonna show you guys how we got the tickets and all of that. But um, this is an outdoor game, so I'm really happy the weather held up. We're gonna take a look at the shops and see if we can pick something up. I bought the tickets online. This was from the Tigers website. I printed out this confirmation with a QR code. Around gate nine, there are uh, QR machines. So you just basically scan this and your tickets print out immediately. So it was very fast and very efficient. Bento boxes. So my bento box is Hojo number two. So here is what my bento box looks like. The one I wanted was sold out, so in a panic, I chose this one instead. And my hubby got number 94. And here's my hubby's bento. games in Japan, the opposite team has its own cheering section. The fans basically cheer for their favorite team, but they don't really heckle the other team. So everyone's really quiet when Nagoya is up to bat, which is um, who the Hanshin Tigers are facing tonight. Cheering section cheers, everyone else is quiet, and then the reverse happens when uh, the Tigers are up to bat. Also, every player has their own special song and the crowd chants their name in their own unique way, so that's really cool too.
starting to blow balloons again. So I guess we're gonna be doing the uh, release. So it is our last day in Osaka, last day in Japan. We're actually leaving today. We're gonna be heading to the train station and then going to Narita Airport and then taking our flight back. So it's going to be a very, very long travel day. All I've done is moisturize. I filled in my brows and I have some mascara on. A little bit tired, so please excuse the dark circle. We are having our last kombini breakfast. We've already shared an onigiri. And now we're gonna be having this ham and egg sandwich. I wanted to show you guys because it's kind of like those um, sandwiches you used to make with that sealing machine. I can't remember what it's called. I used to have one. I would put marshmallows in like white bread with whatever else and you could seal it and it would um, cut off the crusts and kind of make like a sandwich pocket like these. It comes out in two pieces and I'm not sure if you're supposed to eat them separately or together. Okay, so here is how they come. I'm just gonna bite into both of them at the same time. Okay, so far, I haven't hit the filling yet. Bread is good though, nice and soft. Mmm. They're the same. They actually taste really good. The egg tastes like hard boiled egg. Very mild flavor. So I've been into both, but I'm gonna give one to my hubby and eat the other one. But this is really good. I like this a lot. If I had discovered this earlier, I might have purchased uh, more of these. This wasn't at the 7-Eleven. I can't remember the name of the convenience store, but it's one that we hadn't been to before. But this tastes really good. You want half? One sandwich? It's good. <laughs> I didn't know because I didn't know if I bit into it together. I thought one was ham and one was egg. So here is the last thing we picked up for our kombini breakfast. These are um, banana shaped cakes and I'm assuming they have banana filling in them. So let's open this guy up. I guess we could have done more um, tasting videos like this. This hotel is quite spacious and there's a ledge right um, in front of the window so I can prop the camera up and sit on the ground. And it would have been really good for taste test videos but um, I didn't think of that in time. So I will eat one and give my hubby the other one. They smell really sweet. So it's a banana shaped cake and it says banana on the front. It smells like a ripe banana. It's super sweet though. 
Okay. Wanna try? It's almost like a banana flavored bean paste inside. It is very banana-y and very, very, very sweet. I'm just gonna grab my coffee. <laughs> this is drinking in front of me. Make up all these words. Um, okay. Mm. It's good with the coffee. Mmm. I like the bean paste a lot. It's that bean paste texture. Mm, really good. It's just very, very sweet. Okay, I think that's it. We're gonna be heading out soon.